Hi, this is Patrick from BIM Object, and this is the new Crawford DS6060A dock shelter from Asa Abloy Entrance Systems. Uh, we'll have a deeper look uh, into this object in this video, uh, whilst the actual development is made out of a series of dock shelters. Uh, as you can see here in the menu, we also have the 6060P, 6070B and the 6070R. Uh, but as I said, the 6060A is focused on this presentation. So as you can see in the right side here, we have the user interface uh, with the different kinds of settings. This is a, uh, some ki a kind of a uh, configurator. So depending on which widths and the heights you choose, you get different options of uh, combining the, these parameters. Everything to help you to actually configurate these dock shelters in the constraints of what can be delivered. The second page here is the selection guide. Uh, this helps you further to actually specify what kind of a dock shelter you need. And it also specifies uh, the different technical uh, properties of this particular product. And if you continue to the third, uh, third page, uh, you also have the possibility to, sh to change what kind of connection you want to the uh, already constructed wall. You have three options here, the cavity wall, the concrete wall, or the insulated wall option. Uh, you also get detail detailed drawings here and the instructions what the different parts are. Uh, on the next page, we have the possibility to add accessories and options. So you can choose the parking guides color between white and yellow. You have rain channels, split curtains, uh, reinforced rubber flaps, corner seals. Uh, the corner seals are available in two options. Um, and also we have a extensive description of the product itself. Here you have the ARCHICAD specific settings for 3D detailing and 2D detailing and at the last page uh, links back to uh, relevant information and technical documentation as well. So if I go in here and change some settings, I change some, some width and heights and so on and I click OK, you can see we get uh, instant uh, result in the 3D view here. And of course it's not just the dimensional parameters that are uh, geometrically visible for you, it's of course also the accessories which is available. So if I click in everything here just to show you what happens is that uh, we get actual geometry on everything of it from rain gutters and so on and also the number uh, on the front here because there's a possibility for you to number each uh, individual dock shelter as you would in, in real planning. So if I go in here again and change from 1 to 152 for example you can see it changes accordingly in 3D view as well. So let's jump back in here in the user interface and deactivate all the accessories uh, and options here and move on to uh, what we have uh, the corner seals to show you those. We have some pyramid shaped corner seals here as, ex as an example. Uh, also we have the cylindrical ones. Uh, and it's not only in the user interface you can change uh, the different parameters. You can do it in live in and dynamic in the 3D view as well. So here I'm changing the height, for example, the depth of the shelter and so on. Um, so everywhere you see a purple hotspot, you have a dynamic option where you can actually uh, adjust things on this product. So if you find this product interesting, it's available for you to download, download at the beamobject.com portal uh, or via our app. Uh, but also at the Asabloy Entrance Systems private cloud. Thank you for watching.